Oh, you're here. Please do come in. Hello, Henry, darling. I'm sure you must be quite surprised to see me. The last time we saw each other was at your brother's funeral. May you rest in peace. You know as well as anyone, though, that Arthur and I's marriage was far from our choice. I mean, we never even slept together. He was just in such an ill health, it would have been impossible for us. Enough about the past, though. My name is Catherine Aragon. I'm 32 years old, and I enjoy reading, listening to music, and I'm a devout Catholic. I work at England Co. I'm mainly a liaison between England Co. and Spain Co. My parents run Spain Co would be very supportive of this union, although that's not the only reason I'm interested. Since our first meeting, I thought you were rather handsome and charming. Oh dear, look at the time. I must bid you adieu. I'm late for mass. I don't want to tarry. Hey, how you been, Henry? Well, I hope. I haven't seen you in a few days. This is Anne, by the way, not Mary. I know you were rather fond of my sister for a while, but she's married now, you know. No need to hide those smoldering glances anymore. <laughs> Did you think I hadn't noticed? I mean, there's always been a strong attraction between us, and I know you feel it too, but I'm not like Mary, Henry. I'm not looking for a roll in the hay. I don't put out without a ring. If you're not interested though in a girl who prefers to wait, then don't bother me. You know where to find me if you are though. You know I am Catherine's personal assistant, which isn't bad work, but I think I'd be much more help to you. I worked at French Co. for a little bit. Their CEO, Francis Roy, was rather fond of me. He was devastated when I left. And my father, Thomas Bolin, is on the board of directors for England Co. Also, unlike some members of the board, like that dreadful Mr. Woolsey, us Bolins only want the best for England Co. Think about it. Well, ta-ta, Henry. I'm sure I'll be seeing you very soon. Hey Henry, it's Jane Seymour, the same Jane that works with Anne Bolin on 4-2. I truly enjoy working at England and Company. Catherine is such a role model to me. I'm not quite as fond of Anne, but she's okay. I mean, I'm not crazy about all those catty looks she's always shooting at you, or the way she glares at me when I talk to you, but I'm not here to talk about Anne. So, on to me I guess. I'm 24 as of last week. Thank you for the flowers, by the way. I'm an Orthodox Catholic. I have two brothers, Thomas and Edward, who also works at England Company. And I enjoy hunting and horseback riding. Also, I must tell you, I'm a woman who does as the Bible says. I believe in complete celibacy before marriage. Jane, dear. Oh, I must bid you adieu, Henry. My mother calls. I am Anne Cleves, and I would like you to consider this as a proposal, a, a business-based proposal. I am the younger sister of Duke Cleves, one of the gentlemen on the board of directors for German Co. A marriage between us could have many potential benefits for both companies, and I've heard many of your own board members, like Mr. Cromwell, support the idea. Enough politics, though. I'm 20 years old attending college, but I am undecided on a major. My religion is Lutheran Protestant, but I would be willing to convert to Catholicism. My family thinks little of the fine arts, so I know nothing of modern music or dance, but I am very good at sewing. My brother also dislikes modern contraptions, which is why he insisted I hide my face, but this portrait painting by a French has a great likeness to me. Bring in the portrait. Thank you for your time. Come in. Oh, is it time for the interview? Hi. Like, hey Henry, how's it going? It's 
It's me, Catherine Howard, but you can call me Cat. You know, Anne's cousin, the one that requested an internship. I'm totally underused, though. Anne just uses me as like a glorified coffee girl. But I guess I should be thankful because working for the Upper Court of England Co. is where I met you, England and Co.'s very own CEO. Well, a hundred more important things, like me. I graduated last month. Hashtag 18 and free. Um, my favorite color is pink and purple and neon and sparkly. Well, um, I'm going to Ivy Tech next year because I'm not very good at math or science or English. But I'm like really good at music stuff. My music teacher, Mr. Mannox, compliments me all the time. Too bad I didn't get along with Francisca, a friend of mine who's definitely not male, and I'm totally still a virgin. Um, oh, and my goal in life is to be a trophy wife. But I'm not interested in auditioning. But why do I have to? Hello? Hello? Um, hello? My name is Catherine Parr, though most of the time I go by Kathy. Um, I'm not really sure why I'm here. You're a great guy, Henry, don't get me wrong, but I've already been married twice, and I have two stepchildren. And up until yesterday, I thought I was going to be married again to someone else. You know Thomas, Thomas Seymour. <laughs> He works at England and Co. And we've been talking about getting married soon. We've been seeing each other for a while. I was really excited, but all up in a sudden yesterday, he got transferred to California. And I was absolutely shocked and devastated when Thomas left. And next thing I know, you're auditioning to be your bride. But I um, guess I should make the best of the situation. I am 26 years old. I like writing. I've actually written a few books, some of them of which are published. I absolutely hate censor censorship, and I am pro-reformation. Um, I believe that is all, so thank you, I guess. <laughs> Hello, Henry Dog. Enough about the past, though. My name is Catherine of Aragon. I'm 32 years old. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Moving the page. <laughs> hey, how have you been, Henry? Well, I hope I haven't. What? Did you think I hadn't noticed? And there's always been a strong attraction between us and okay I'm sorry <laughs> did you think I hadn't noticed I mean there's always been a strong uh, attraction okay. also I'm like s sorry <laughs> hey Henry it's Jane Seymour the same Jane that works on floor two I'm an orthodox catholic I hate my life Mom! Mom! Jane, dear! Mom, come in! Oh. Also, I must tell you, I am a woman who does as the Bible says. I complete. I complete. <laughs> Courtney Maud. <laughs> Courtney! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going. Go for it. I can just trim. Okay. Hey Henry, it's Jane Seymour. The same Jane that works with Anne Bolin. My acting career is over. I'm done now. I'm just, just gonna sit You did just such a fantastic job though. <gasps> I almost stopped. I was just like, oh! Well, I mean, at least I got friendly with that wall. I like it, it's green. I'm gonna stretch this. Thanks for being in this video, Courtney. <laughs>